to read right babe yes. it's time for us to read every single ultra beast available in pokemon go yeah. as uh, we've got that to do today but where are we now babe egypt yeah we're in egypt over here in front of a store with a lot of monuments yeah. actually we just came out from a church and our guide is all the way in front so we're actually here for a family trip my family trip and uh, they have went in front first because we got to work on this video but hi hi to all of you guys hi guys all right so let's go to bring my screen now. you guys can see that there are no raids around us because it's currently 10 a.m. in the morning here in Egypt and the raids I guess will start in a few minutes. I'm gonna put myself online and hopefully we can receive some raids. So the raid that I need to receive right now is Zaki Tree because Zaki Tree is ending soon in the other time zone. We are actually six hours behind of Singapore and hopefully my friends will be able to send me some raids because they are left with just 36 minutes. All right, we just got ourselves a Zaki Tree raid. Whoa, how lucky, babe. Look at it. I can't believe it. So we got seven raids to do, all right? We got seven. Oh, should I buy this part? Yeah, I'm gonna buy this first. We got seven raids to do in total, all right? One of each of the Ultra Beast and hopefully we can get something really awesome. None of them will be shiny though but uh, one thing i'd like to mention that uh, really kind of sucks is that uh, we actually arrived here roughly four hours ago right babe? yeah so what happened after we arrived here we lost our luggage yeah all nine of our luggages except my dad's yeah, luggage all right ten here. of us you know made it here but nine of our luggages are missing so we probably have to go naked tomorrow oh, <laughs> so we had to change our plans and actually we were supposed to go to the pyramid now but unfortunately we ain't able to and uh, it's just really unfortunate but we had breakfast really good breakfast yeah. already and here yeah. we are having another i guess a small little snack to actually take on zaki tree all right mm -hmm. and we will just uh, jump straight to the part where the battle ends because uh, i'm just going to show you guys the hundo check and uh, me catching the zaki tree Alright, I don't think I'll be showing you guys every single battle. I've probably shown that already in other videos, alright? But uh, yeah, let's continue walking. Let's go! It's super crowded, guys. No joke. <laughs> alright, guys, we took down the Zerky tree. Let's go ahead to catch it. And the good thing is that we have Beast Ball to use. Oh, yeah, hi, man. So we have Beast Ball to use because uh, I guess a lot of people put in the effort to actually um, ref refer people, man. Hello, yeah, what's up, man? Alright, see you, man. Alright, and uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Say hi, man. Yeah, Hello. say hi. Yeah. Alright, <laughs> no, thank you, man. See you, man. Joke. All right, what's up, man? So, um, yeah, that's that, man. And uh, I guess the people here are really friendly. I'm not sure what they're saying, but if it's something vulgar, then I'm sorry, I guess. But uh, yeah, we are lost. We're gonna have to find my family. Let me message uh, my brother to see which Pokestop he's at. They play Pokemon Go too. Well, guys, we are walking in circles. We are technically lost. My, my father finally shared uh, the live location <laughs> in the group chat, and we are trying to locate them. It's like finding Pokemon. But uh, yeah, this is another Zerky Tree raid. I want to mention one thing though, is that uh, we have been, you know, trying to look for Sigilyph, the regional Pokemon of Egypt and Greece. Unfortunately, we have not seen any of it at all, despite the fact that we have been using our incense all the way. So it looks pretty rare to actually see that, man. Okay, we got a few raids over there, which I will do later on. But uh, I'll show you guys my storage, man. No Sigilyph at all. Not sure, man. Hopefully we can get it soon but the next trade is gonna be nihiligo yeah well guys i found my dad also found my family we're all waiting down there came up to use the restroom and we're also done with the nihiligo raid and uh yeah i think the raids are about to start soon for 11 o'clock and uh, in the last few hours i've also been raiding uh Zekitri and also katana because those two are the most important pokemon out of all the ultra bees as everything else i don't really need the candy xl or whatever for already but i would like to get a hundo Zekitri because it's something i've not gotten yet none also i can't really talk too loud over here because uh, our guide told us to be a bit quiet the, over here as uh, there are some prayers going on in the church there are actually like two churches over here it's really awesome with the beast ball though All right we completed that collection challenge so this collection challenge you have to get it from the stream i believe so the stream that you can get the code which my friends send to the group chats and uh, that's that i think maybe there are more codes that we can get let me check out the group chat all right raid number three guys my guide our guide is explaining the churches and stuff to us to my family but i'm here doing this review it's gonna be gas lot all right and uh it is not as shiny but we're gonna do the next raid we got four more raids to do all right the beast ball is really awesome and so easy to catch it with and you guys can see that the circle is yellow and it's not red so it's gonna be really easy to catch you know what 
I think if we golden raspberry, it's just gonna be super duper easy to get. Anyway, I don't have a hundo gas slot yet, so it'd be really awesome to get it. Also, sixteen fifty will be the hundo. See, so look at it. Anyhow, throw, anyhow, play. We actually get the gas slot also. Also, four candy XL. And I see, still no rates. Twenty minutes more. Oh wait, we just completed another challenge. Awesome. Oh my god, guys, we are like walking through a maze. Yeah. Look at that. Look at how many books are there around us. It's so insane. Many. But here we are, man. Katana is gonna chop up the books, and you know, Katana is actually made from paper. <laughs> so much paper around us right now. Yeah. Alright, it's an origami Pokemon. And here we are to catch it. This is rate number four, I believe. So we got 17 balls. It's amazing. I do not have a Hando Katana yet, so it'd be nice to actually get one. Unfortunately, it's not. Anyway, my brother. He's busy taking photos, so I got a bit of time to do this vlog. So awesome, caught it. We're gonna continue walking. And we can go. Let's go. Well, guys, we are entering a church. Apparently, our guide said that it's supposed to be a hanging church. Not sure if we will see something floating or not. That's why I told him. But here we are, we will see something really floating in the end. That in this Crucelia, not Crucelia, Celestia. Babe, I forgot this Pokemon is called Celestia and not Crucelia. Oh. I said Crucelia, oh my god. I mean, Crucelia is floating also, right? Uh -huh. So, same, same, I guess. Yeah. But we're gonna catch this now. Go for it. Alright, and this will be done because this is from the Southern Hemisphere. I mean, in Egypt, it's also still in the Northern Hemisphere. So, we get Katana here also later on in seven minutes' time. Yeah, I wanna show you guys something interesting also, though. Yeah. Alright, we caught the Celestia. I wanna show you guys this. Look at the location Cairo, Egypt. <laughs> it's my first time ever catching a Pokemon from Cairo and it's a little bit exciting especially I know that there's a chance to get catch Sigilyph but look at the sighting there's nothing yet yeah there's no Sigilyph yet and I have not caught a single one so very rare man wait what do we have here we got a red oh we just missed that sorry Johnson we are done guys done <laughs> spending time at the church yes. But we are out. We just got out. Yeah, we are out. And we got a raid over here. And Nihiligo that despawns in 2 hours and 15 minutes because the Ultra Beast raids has just started for us here. And uh, look at that, we got Katana. We got Feromosa. Right, we're going to do the Feromosa. We're going to free pass this Nihiligo first because going somewhere else. But unfortunately, you, no? I thought you said you didn't want to raid? I was checking to see if I could tap on Yeah, she actually now. said that she didn't want to raid this because her network is not so good. But we have to buy a new data yeah. card maybe later on. But I mean, the raid lobby already be. Okay, okay. Yeah, let's okay. go to invite our friends. Okay. And we clear our free pass before we do the Feromosa. Alright. Yeah, uh, they're, they're just looking at the entrance of the museum, yeah. Alright guys, we left the area and we are out of the maze already man. Oh my god, and we yes. caught the Nihili Go, like I said, clear our free pass. Mm -hmm. And uh, we got the Feromosa which we'll be raiding now. Alright, we will remote that but I do not know if she's able to get in yeah. the raid. Just thought she did the raid though. And uh, we just heard something really interesting from our guide. Alright, our guide was asking us about our relationship like between me and her and like my brother and his girlfriend etc. <laughs> And then uh, eventually they thought that we were both husband and wives. I mean, but eventually, that's not the first time. Yeah, I mean, the <laughs> thing is, uh, we told him that actually we are just boyfriend and girlfriend. He said that actually in Egypt, in yeah. Egypt, um, you're supposed to just get married. You're not supposed to have boyfriend and girlfriend. It's uh, a jailable offense according to him. Not sure whether is it true or not, yeah. but uh, maybe it's time for us to break up. <laughs> really? Yep, okay. Goodbye. <laughs> no, yep. you're I don't, don't want to go to jail. I don't want to go to jail. You told uh, them you were married. Yeah, I'm married to Pokemon Go, yeah. yes. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Well guys, we are waiting by the side of the road. Yep. And my guide, our guide said that the bus is supposed to be here. We're waiting for the bus to arrive and we got a Feromosa over here and Feromosa is double weak to flying, so using you know like Shadow Motors is the best option. Unfortunately she's not doing the raid because the network yeah, is really poor. My brother is trying to take a photo of me with the camera. <laughs> I guess first time he's seeing me vlog a uh, live in person. Yeah. <laughs> But uh, yeah, the Feromosa is going to go down really quickly because, you know, it's just yeah, super duper yeah, the Feromosa is going down, man. What the Feromosa is talking about? Hey! He doesn't play Pokemon Go. He doesn't even know what, what am I talking Pokemon? about, man. <laughs> yeah! We're here to see the yeah. mummies. What yeah. Pokemon? We haven't even seen a single mummy yet. We've seen so yeah, many. Nonsense. We've seen all yeah. the mummies already. All the yeah. five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's crazy. <laughs> He's crazier than me, trust me. <laughs> Alright, so we took out the Feromosa. We're going to catch it really quickly. And this is going to be the last raid we're going to show you guys now. Because we have to wait for Basswood to spawn and that will only appear like in a few hours time, probably I estimate to be around four to six hours time when America, you know, um, starts spawning those and my friends from America can send us those raids. But uh, we're still waiting for the bus to arrive and we're gonna catch this Feromosa first. Yeah. You guys don't have to see me catch this, you guys have seen it catch this, especially during the Gold Fest finale, yes, right, babe? Correct. Yeah. Anyway, we caught it. Great. Let's go and catch some mummies now. 
Hey guys, Hi. guess what? We have made it to our accommodation mm -hmm. after collecting our luggages yes, from the luggages. airport. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, it was really crazy and my brother, my eldest brother wasn't able to get his, the yeah. one who you guys saw. And yeah, indeed, we went to see a lot of mummies just now, right Bae? Yes, the 25 royal, royal mummies. Yeah, a lot of them at the museum, the new museum. However, right now we actually have a bus wool. This bus wool was a great invitation mm -hmm. from my friend Daniel, all the way from the Tampa, Florida. Pokemon Latin now he has Florida. moved to Seattle. Unfortunately... <laughs> We ain't able to enter Data it. There were some issues. There were some network issues and we weren't able to enter it anymore. From Pokemon Latin America Championship. Hence why I wanted to show you guys this raid, but it looks like we have to wait for another basketball invite. Oh well. It's okay. Let's go to the room first. Let's go. Mm. Well guys, guess what? We have just checked into our room. Whoa. But we are also just leaving the room. Okay, Whoa. we are leaving the room because my family, we are going out for dinner now. Yeah. We did not even rest for. <laughs> <laughs> a minute at all because we had some stuff to settle at the lobby and my brother is still like preparing himself so we'll meet him in the lobby internet just uh, fainted let me reconnect I need the internet well guys let's just do this in the lift okay so oh sorry we can press one I'm sorry oh, now yeah, it's going did, up it's no no no, no. Oh, it's, yeah, yeah, it's fine alright it's, it's my fault so I want to claim the rewards with you guys because it's left with 16 minutes before everything is gone I'm going to claim the first one actually you guys know why it's just going to be every single one of the Ultra Beast, which uh, we have unlimited uh, Ultra Beast balls to actually uh, catch it with, man, that's quite cool. So uh, initially I was thinking to actually finish the last raid Bass Wool with you guys before I do this, but I guess the next reward is going to be Bass Wool already. Okay, second three, the next next one is probably it. Yeah, but let me catch this. Can't even do fast catch because there are no balls or berry icon to actually do it at all. Yeah, it's guaranteed catch, I guess. Let's see the bus wool over here right now. Are we at the lobby? I think okay, we are. Let's, let's claim this. And uh, let's see that. Network error. Hang on. Oh, well, guys, we got the bus wool. Oh my god, I'm not really sure what's the network, but uh, what's up with the network, but let's go to catch this. Alright, guys, we're gonna claim the next reward. Okay, this one is gonna probably be the Feromosa. Yeah, we kind of fast catch it. Mm -hmm. Next. Oh my god, guys. Sorry for the abrupt transition, but change of plans. Yeah, actually my dad decided to go down and check for the restaurants nearby us to see what's available for dinner. Though uh, we are all kind of tired, wanted to take a break, but he still seems to have all the energy in him to go out and check for stuff, so props to him. I'm here also not having a lot of energy left because I just did um, something really interesting. I just played... VR, okay, I just uh, played Beat Saber and I'm kind of exhausted, but here we are with another Bass Wu raid. I decided to take a break and eventually I just got a raid invite. So uh, yeah, we just jump straight to the part where the Bass Wu is down before I tell you guys some stuff. Whew, and the Bass Wu is down. So yep, I did tell you guys that we've been trying to look for Siggy Leaves in the wild, right? I did a bit of research and I found out that actually Siggy Leaf is really, really rare and hard to come by, man. Uh, apparently it doesn't spawn a lot so uh, really I think it is kind of the rarest uh, regional Pokemon and I might make a video of it uh, I mean showing princess and I catching it hopefully uh, we can even find it we will actually go to the pyramids uh, in the next few days and hopefully we can see some of that there waiting for us to be caught all right so I even told princess that if we see anyone of on on the sighting immediately we're gonna leave and go ahead to catch it um, regardless of whatever we are doing but uh, yeah, I just want to show you guys the other uh, Pokemon that I've caught. I'm going to search for Hundo to see if I get myself any Hundo, Ultra Beast or whatever. Nope, because I've not been uh, knowing the CP for the Hundos or whatever. As for the other, um, yep, Ultra Beast, those are the ones that I've caught. Alright, the Nihiligo all the way to the Celestilia from the Special Research. But um, yeah, they're going to be transferred. I'm not going to, actually I'm going to keep all of them. Because since they're all level 15, I want to keep them and see if whoever want to trade to get a lower CP ones. Especially for the Great Lakes. Alright, especially for Bass Wool, that's the only way you can get uh, Bass Wool at level 15, I mean under 1500 CP. So yep, that is all that I have to show to you guys in this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching me raid every single Ultra Beast. 
and uh, we are happy that you guys uh, join us for this. Also, yeah. are you done with your nails? Um, yeah. Wow, very busy sending. Okay, now, yeah, now. I have to do a little all right, time for bag. you to file my nails for me. <laughs> yeah, all right, it's okay. okay. Never mind. After your video, I'll, I'll you just file your nails. Yeah, I'll bite. I'll just bite them myself. It's fine. Oh uh, my. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I oh haven't even washed my hands yet. But yeah, hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. If you guys did, definitely yes. remember to leave a like, guys. and also to subscribe. And we will see you guys in the next episode. In the next video, hopefully we will actually try to get ourselves the Sigily. Yeah. And uh, we are still spending some time with my family, so um, mm -hmm. like I said, I apologize if the videos are delayed mm -hmm. or whatsoever. Alright, but see you guys soon. Alright, goodbye, goodbye, good. Bye, bye. bye. time to find my nails. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs>